Chronicles of Solo, Solo, Solo to the Colo, Colo, Solo to the Ground, Solo no the Stable. Yes, drop that clipper. What do you know that you're doing? Drop the clipper, my friend. Hey, guys, guys, guys. Have you guys seen this trending video about a girl that embarrassed the entire family on social media? How did she do that? She proposed to a guy in a mall. Almost, the guy said no. I've seen more than three different videos of that foolishness in the last two weeks. It's a trend already, then. Whoa. Solo. What if Uju proposes to you? What will your response be? Where I come from, it's a man that proposes to a woman. It's practically so everywhere. But ladies are really getting impatient these days. That's not even what we're asking. Solo, I answer the question. If Uju proposes to you, what would you do? Will you shut up and mind your business? Who's talking to you? Of course, I'll say no. Uh -uh. That's like allowing a woman to pay your husband price. Uh, instead of you paying a bride price. <laughs> Baby girl, have fun. I'm good, what's up, Kasi? Are you busy? I'm sure you can see that. I have assignments from school. How long will it take now? An hour or two, maybe three, not sure. Oh, you have to put it aside, so if friend needs you right now. No, Kasi, I can't. Yes, you can, and yes, you will. Ah! Cassie! It's urgent now, please. <sighs> now I'm listening, and it had better be worth it. <clears throat> so, I met this guy two weeks ago. I'm not interested. Stop. <sighs> Let me finish now, shoo. Oh, eh? I'll tell this book too. So I met this guy two weeks ago, and ah, would you visit this guy? Husband material, one thousand yards. As I am like this, I've married him. <laughs> but the only thing is that I invited him over for dinner, mm -hmm. and ha, ah, I promised him semo and vegetable soup precisely. And how will I do it? You don't know how to cook. Eh, hey, don't insult me. I just wanted to help me, you know, do some things now. I, I want this one to be very special. You know, draw to a man's heart is through his stomach. I don't want to use this, your, our food, to win him over. Cassie, please now. Is it possible to say no to you? Will you help me? Okay. Let's go. Yay! Yeah, let's go. Let's go now. Let's go. Time is going. Yeah, come sit down. No, no, I'm okay standing. I'd rather stand so that you all will hear the points that I want to make in this conversation. Because me, I, I, I don't see anything wrong with a woman proposing. You know, as, as long as she has all the money, yeah, to change my life and make it better. Ah, I'm, I'm willing to, to, to say yes to a proposal. What are you saying? <laughs> Naomi say you go be wife for the marriage and she go be husband. Um, no, no, not, not necessarily. <laughs> wait, 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 Tony. Why would you want to get married to a woman that has more money than you? There's nothing wrong with that. What's, what's wrong with that? You know when a woman is earning more than you, it's very hard. In fact, it's impossible for her to be submissive. I should have go raise. See, I don't care if she's submissive or not. As long as she has all the money in the world to change my life, eh? I'm willing to be in the house as a house husband. You know you look like a gold digger right now. Just look at yourself. Eh? I'd, rather, I'd rather be a gold digger eh? than wallow in poverty. So, Naimbi say, if a woman tells you to be a full house husband while she goes to work, you say yes. 
Yes, now there, there's nothing wrong with that now. I, I, in fact, I will happily stay at home as a house husband. What are you saying? Come on, my shop. Come on, they go. Hey, calm down now. We're just having a conversation now. Which conversation? Oga, say come out from my shop. You are not fit to be a man. Leave my salon. Stop. Leave. Uh -uh. Guy. Leave my salon. This is the problem. It's in your spiral slippers. <laughs> wow, you really threw him out, Jack. <laughs> of course. How can a man not have a problem with a woman being the breadwinner of the family? Actually, there's nothing wrong with a lady being more financially stable than the man. It's like you want to join him, Abby. Michael, calm down. Let me explain. Explain what? Ah, solo, chill now. Let him explain. Guy, explain. So if you meet a lady and you genuinely love her, and in the process of you guys dating, she becomes more prosperous than you, Will you break up with her because she's successful? Now that you are put it like that, it's like Michael has a point. How can a woman be more successful than a man? Is it not that you are supposed to double your hustle as a man? Mm -hmm. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, yeah. Solomon, I feel you there. I mean, a man needs a financial upper hand to stay in control. Mm -hmm. okay. so, Come on, let's look at it this way. If you get a job with an oil company after she graduates from school, and she earns a month what you make in a year. Will you kill yourself? Tutu. Uh, Michael, did you see what uh, Chelsea and Asna played yesterday? Answer the question, guy. Okay, uh. <laughs> <laughs> this is not. The match was very strong. <laughs> was very, very strong. <laughs> Let's change the topic. Answer me. You see, Michael, yeah. Hmm? The network is bad. Solo to the colo, colo, solo to the ground. Solo no the stable. Hello, Cassie. Cassie, I just spent 20 minutes at your apartment teaching you how to cook a simple vegetable soup. And here you are calling me again. Cassie, I can't. Bye. Did you switch on the phone? Yes, I did. You were disturbing me. Oh, so why are you trying to be an enemy of progress now? I beg your pardon. See, you need to come and me and cook that food though. I have an assignment to finish. I can't. And I have a husband material to impress. See, we do this guy is a chef now. I cannot cook any other food for him now. Cassie, go and cook it however you know best. He will eat it with love. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Just I will never forgive you. I will never forgive you for making me lose my husband. I will not forgive you. I will not forgive you. It's fine. It's fine. You win again. I'll help you. Thank you. I just think it's best to tell him you don't know how to cook. So he can love you for who you are. I know how to cook, don't insult me. Let's go, Joe. Keep, Keep telling on. yourself that. Babe, I'm home. Would you? Would you? Did you go? Cassie's apartment, been helping her cook. You said you had loads of school assignments. That's why you couldn't come to the shop. Not because you wanted to be Cassie's cook. Yeah, I was working on my school stuff before she came and insisted I had to come help her cook. For a guy she's expecting. I hope you did not empty all our kitchen stuff for her again. No, she bought all the ingredients. All she needed was my skill. Mm. So she basically came to borrow your cooking skills the same way she comes to borrow your clothes, your shoes, your bags, and other stuff. She's my friend. I had to help her. Keep obliging all her crazy requests. One day she will soon come and ask to borrow your brains and not return it. Chronicles of solo, solo, solo to the colo, colo, solo to the ground, solo no the stable.
Yeah. Uh, I'm inside the compound now. Oh, okay. That's fine. Oh, uh, all right. See you soon. Hi. Hello. Good afternoon. Hi. Are you looking for someone? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm looking for Cassie. Uh, are you our brother? Oh, no. <laughs> no, I'm her boyfriend. Oh, then you must be the chef. I must be. My name is David. <laughs> My name is Solomon. I'm Cassie's neighbor and I've heard about you. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Yeah. I hope that now that she has a boyfriend, she will leave me and my girlfriend alone. How do you mean? Look, your girlfriend is a pest. She's always coming babe. to- Babe! Hey! Hey, Someone babe! Someone was keeping you. You told me you were here. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm good. How are you? Just having a, just having a chat with your neighbor. <laughs> chat about what? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> just a business proposal. <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Let okay. us bros. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Take it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. How you doing? Good yeah. to see you. I'm coming! One minute! Photography job. Why? He's not back. Nah, he's not. What's up? David is here. And I saw Solomon and David talking outside. So? So I'm wondering what they were talking about now. <sighs> Chill. I'm sure it's nothing. I don't trust Solo. I don't trust him. So what do you think Solomon and David will possibly be discussing to get to this worked up? How am I supposed to know? But Shahim, warn him all, warn Solomon, tell him that I will kill him. I will end his life if he ruins this thing for me. Stop being pessimistic. Solomon, my Solomon is not that kind of man. Yeah. What will you say before? Anyways, let's go to your apartment so you can introduce me to David. Uh -oh. Where will I do that? Because I'm your friend. Sister, this time. It's not today you will miss him more. You miss him another day. And why not? Ujo, our relationship is still young now. Eh? I can't be exposing him to distractions and confusions. What? Would you see you're a fine girl. You're a fine girl. I cannot be introducing you to my boyfriend. I'm still trying to bond with. Oh. Cassie, what is wrong with you? Are you serious? Oga, okay, you're speaking English. I'll see you later, I beg. Cassie! So till now you don't know how to handle the clipper. Take. What are you trying to do? I want to show you how to handle it now. No, try it with your own head. How can I see my head? Bring your head. Look at the mirror. <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> I thought you'd been banned from coming here. Me, a, a whole brand ambassador to this your barber shop. So someone was clearly out of his mind yesterday. I'm here to give him another opportunity to apologize before you people lose a very, very loyal customer. Hmm. I honestly don't think we'll miss you if we lose you as a customer, Sha. What's that supposed to mean? Don't you know the, you guys know that the customer is always right? That's for a paying customer, not one that always come here for a free haircut. See, I'll pretend I did not just hear what you just said, eh? I'll pretend I did not hear that. Bye bye. Come and give me a haircut, Joe. I gotta stand up. No problem, I'm capable. Very capable. Yeah, Michael, come and bat my head. He's, he's on his break. He's on his Parker, break. do your thing. Parker. Take everything down. Are you, are you Brand right? ambassador, Mike. Michael. See, Parker, Par Par if I, if I. Is it not school you said you are going? Yes. And why do you have so much makeup? Solo, please don't start. Later, you say some of your lecturers and students are disturbing you and asking you out. Why won't they ask you out? When you are making up as if you are single and desperately searching. Can you please stay off my case today? By the way, Cassie said she saw you and her chef boyfriend yesterday when he came. Mm -hmm. Yes. She was worried. What did you two talk about? Why is she worried if she's done nothing wrong? 
Solomon, please stay out of her relationship. She seems to really like this one. Mm. Has she been staying out of her own relationship? Has she not always been poking her nose into our business and leaving off us? I've warned you. Let's do your makeup small, small. Uju! Uju! Ah, now, but I was calling you now. I heard you. I didn't just want to answer so I don't distract and confuse your boyfriend. <laughs> Are you still angry about what I said yesterday? Leave me alone, Cassie. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to offend you. It's just that I love this guy so much and I don't want to take chances by introducing my pretty friend to him. I have my own boyfriend. Hey, that's why I don't trust you. But you know how men can be now. So what's the point of being with him if you don't trust him? Hey, that's why I don't trust him. But I, I just don't want to lose this relationship. That, that's all. You are getting too paranoid and I hope you don't ruin this for yourself. Where are you off to? I have a meeting uh, for a modeling deal. Is that why you're looking this one? As I should. <laughs> <laughs> sure, I can ride with you so that I like, can drop me there. It's God that said I should see you. <laughs> it's God that said I should see you. Be going, you know, my sister. <laughs> it's not me going. Hold on. Hello. Hi. David, right? Uh, yes. Uh, I was in the neighborhood and I thought to stop by. Um, Cassie should be at home. Uh, no, she's not. I put a call through to her and she said she wasn't here. Uh, okay. Is she I'm here to see? Uh, really? Uh, yes. Okay. Thank you. You can feel at home. That's it. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry to bother you. Okay. Uh, but we were having a conversation yesterday. We didn't get to finish before Cassie interrupted us. We were? Uh, yes, we were. Um, while we were having the conversation yesterday, uh, I noticed Cassie was a little bit... Um, uncomfortable and you know I, I, I it left me really curious you know curious about what exactly <sighs> you see I really like Cassie a lot and I have been hurt one too many times I don't think I, I can handle any more of that anymore and uh, I was really hoping you could help. So what exactly do you want to know about Cassie? <sighs> guy to guy. I just want to know more about Cassie. I, I, and I don't, I don't know. Do you, do you think she's a girl you can recommend to your own brother? I, I know, I, I know we just, we only just met, but Guy to guy, brother to brother. Can you recommend her to me? Chronicles of solo, solo, solo to the colo, colo, solo to the ground. Yeah. Yeah. The story of a guy. a guy, his name is named Solo. Solo, Solo de two colo. Colo. He loves a girl. a girl, her name, her name, Oju. Oju. 
Who just fine, who just calm, she is classy. You know they take and play, you know they take and joke. So low fi die for her, now a day he go fight for her. So low the jealousy, so low is controlling. So low the vex, so low the nag, you know the hear story. Chronicles of solo, solo, solo to the colo, colo, solo to the ground. Solo no the stay. Chronicles of solo, solo, 